Oh, right. Serato 3.2 is now out. Um, so we're going to check it out. So if we head over to Google and type in Serato 3.2. Serato 3.2 is out. Um, 860 megabytes of storage. So Serato 3.2 is now out and includes Serato's upgraded suite of custom inbuilt effects. I don't know how long it's been since Serato have not updated their effects, but this is well overdue so they got new effects powered by serato native apple silicon support i mean that's for m1 m2 and m3 macbooks i don't have an m m1 or m2 or m3 i currently have a macbook 2.6 gigahertz 6 core intel core i7 with 32 gigabytes of ram that here does not apply to me it just has some updates for um some controllers so brain performer rain 4 Serato stem support with Tidal DJ extension and Alpha Theta Euphonia support. So let's read the whole release notes just to get a whole full idea of it. So they have new Serato effects. Experience a full suite of new effects. Powerful custom built enhancements are here. Dive into mix with high quality effects you know and love. It's now significantly upgraded and carefully crafted by Serato. Create your signature sound with custom effects. For the first time in Serato, take full control over your effects. Exclusively available to suite, expansions and FX license holders. Create, save, name and manage an unlimited amount of custom presets tailored exactly to your style. I mean, this is sounding good. Creative channel effects. Assign four different sounds with a new channel effects section, allowing you to move beyond a default filter knob effect. Enhance view modes, explore our redesign interface with advanced parameters designed to enhance your control and flexibility. Utilize a slim view mode for more library viewing. Okay, so there's some updates coming. There's, there's, there's good updates here. So then, like I said, Apple Silicon support. So we've got new features, um, we've already, already gone through that. And then other changes, manual loops now respect quantized value, CPU and memory optimization, uh, hardware changes to effects, and then a couple bug fixes that we don't really need to go through. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna download Serato 3.2 and check it out. I've got the Rev 1 here, so um, we're gonna try everything out um, on here. So let's download 3.2. <clears throat> so that's downloading now. All right, cool, that's downloaded. Let's head over to my downloads. Just pop that open quickly. So yeah, Serato DJ Pro installer, continue, continue, agree. 2.43 gigabytes of space in your computer. Cool, install. Right, the installation was successful. Let's close that, move that to the bin, and let's open up Serato 3.2. Right, so we're in Serato 3.2. New effects designed by Serato, native Apple Silicon support, and then some recent updates that we re read previously. So we're in Serato now. Um, I've got my music pack in here. If you wanna get these 24 free tracks for beginners, check the link in the description down below. So the main thing of Serato 3.2 is the effects, right? So we're gonna slap a track on. Right, so we're gonna just test this track on my Rev 1, so. All right, so let's have a look at these effects. So if we come up to the top up here, all right, so it's different to how it used to be. So, so let's have a look. So on the left-hand side, we've got LFP, LP. So I normally use um, the echo effect. So let's go to echo. That, they got some new, whoa, hang on a minute. This is different. Right, so they, so I don't know how, like, if you lot have seen the, the, the effects on the other versions, it's a lot messier than this. So this, this, this looks good. So this has been cleaned up now. So you got them categorized into delay and echo. Uh, distortion, filter, repeater, modulation, out effects, reverb. Okay, I like this, I like this. So I'm gonna choose echo for this one, and then I'm gonna choose, um, where is reverb? Reverb for this one, and then we're gonna try something I've never used before. So let's have a look at these out effects. So clean echo out. Oh, they've got combo fade out. I'm gonna check them out in a minute. So. Right, so on the left hand side, we've got echo, reverb, and clean echo out. On the right deck, we're gonna do, I don't know, flanger, um, tremelo, never seen that one before. And we're gonna use repeater, never used that one before. So I'm just assuming, so if I go on my Rev 1, so if I click one, and then I move, um, if I turn this on, 
All right, so that's gonna turn that on. So if I just play this one track. All right, so that's, no that, that's normal. So let's try reverb. All right, that's all right. And then clean echo out. So clean echo out is gonna be one that most DJs are gonna use. So let's try that. So I'm gonna to go to effect three on my rev one, play this. Alright, that's not oh hang on. That's weird because <laughs> why does that turn off like that? Alright, so let me turn up the if I turn up the depth. So why does that turn off like that? That needs to carry on playing when I've let go of it because that's that's a bit rubbish. I don't like that. I don't like that. That needs to carry on once I've let go of it. So we've got, what else we got in here? So we can change this to dub echo, so channel effects, so filter. Oh, okay, so, okay, so the filter, so let's see. So if I play this. All right, so that's the filter. If I change that to dub echo. Can't say I'd use that, but reverb. Oh, okay, so you can use reverb on the filter knob now. All right, that's new. And then noise. You see all these effects here? I literally only use echo and reverb in my DJ sets. I don't even use the filter, but this, this, this could be helpful to most DJs. So. I'm assuming these banks here, so if I want to save, I don't know, echo, reverb, and clean, uh, clean echo out to bank A, I can click, oh no. So that's just reset now. <laughs> so let me put back um, echo, um, reverb, and clean echo out on this. And then I'm going to save that to A. Okay, cool. So now... If I change the B, C, D, if I go back to A, that's gonna have my effect. So if I do that, oh, okay, so it does it for this other side as well. So if I wanna change the, so repeater, ping pong delay, and then phaser. So I'm gonna save that to A. So every time I go to A now, that's gonna be saved. Okay, that's interesting, that's cool. What else is in here? So let's have a look at the release notes again. So it says that, if I go to here, experience a full suite of new effects. You know what? We're gonna go through every single effect here. We're gonna, they got this whole batch of new effects, yeah? We're gonna go through every single one. So we're gonna start from the top, yeah? So delay, right? So I'm gonna play the first track. So we're gonna use effect one. All right, so that's delay, I like that. So echo, we've already used this one, but let's go again. So that's echo, um, ping pong delay. Okay, so that's gonna that's going off by one beat. So let's go back one. Let's go let's go down to half. That's a good that's a good echo out effect. All right, so version echo. I have no idea when I'll use these effects. Bit crush. Ooh. I mean, I don't like that one. Um, distortion. Do you know what? I don't even know when I'd ever use these effects. Um, combo filter. Okay, okay. So, but you know what, it's good that they have a new, uh, more, like more of a range of effects now, because before they had none. So HPV. All right, okay. Uh, LFO filter. 
So it's just a standard feel. I'm going to change the track now. Let me go to Afrobeats track two. Remember, you can get all these tracks for free. Check the link in the description down below. Right, so where we at? Um, so LPF. All right, where we got? Repeater. Right, so we've got uh, flanger. This is this is quite a common one. All right. Um, what else we got? Phaser. That was there before. All right. Transform. Oh, do you know what? So let's go to tremolo. What the hell is this? Sure. What else we got? Break echo. This will be a good one. All right, that's cool. Like that. Um, breaker. That was in the old Serato. Interesting. Uh, clean echo out, we've done already, so there's no point in that. Combo fade echo. Ooh, that could be useful. All right. Echo out, we all know this one. The most the most basic effect every single DJ will use. What else have we got? So we've got epic reverb. I don't know what's so epic about it, but let's go. Nice, all right, that sounds all right, actually. That actually sounds quite epic. Epic reverb drop. Christ, all right. <laughs> and then reverb, we've already used that one as well. Okay, cool, so that's the new pool of all the different effects. So that's quite sick, okay. Let me go to settings and go to effects, okay. So that just allows you to do favorite effects. So let me just put in some favorite effects in here. So Echo is my favorite. Uh, we're gonna put in Flanger, Phaser, Epic Reverb. And then we've got this new thing up here called Use Favorite Effect List. So I'm gonna tick that. So I wanna, I wanna know how to use these custom effects. Um, so can I not do, do I need to pay for this? So if I go to, I, I, I guess, I guess I don't have Serato effects. So because I don't have Serato effects, I can't actually do all the custom things. Well, I need to get Serato effects. So if you want me to do a video fully on Serato effects and you want me to buy the expansion pack, type in effects into the comments down below. Now we've gone through that and you've seen this video, check that video out here.